Hey guys, Needless Space here and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about Destiny 2 and the fastest way to get to light level 1000. Real quick, if you guys can appreciate guides that are very easy to follow and get straight to the point, please like the video and subscribe to the channel for more. Now let's get to the video. First off, this video is for Guardians who are at least level 950. If you haven't hit 950 yet, you can literally do just about any activity and the gear will drop higher than what you are up until the soft cap of 950. And then you can follow along with this strategy I'm about to show you. So this strategy is definitely for players like me who have very little time to actually play the game. You don't want to have to grind out every single powerful gear activity and every pinnacle activity. But if you do have the time, I will show you at the end of the video how you can maximize your gains. So first off, we're going to have to get some powerful gear to drop. Now, the fastest way to do this, the most efficient way, is to go into the PvP playlist and jump into the competitive mode, Survival. Specifically, the solo queue if you don't have anyone to play with. And if you're not a big PvP fan, which I'm not either, I still highly recommend giving this method a shot. You get powerful gear after each rank up, and after one match, I was able to get two pieces of powerful gear and increase my light level by one. And don't worry, you can still get powerful gear to drop without doing any PvP. Any of these gold star activities on the destination tab will give you powerful gear, and you could even just knock out bounties for vendors at the tower, or there are plenty of activities to do on the moon, and so on. Now, after you've gotten a few pieces of powerful gear to drop, make sure you check every so often at your base power level, and then look and see if you have any piece of gear that might be trailing behind your base power. If you do notice any piece of gear that is falling behind from your base power level, you're going to want to balance it all out and fill in the gaps. Now, to do this, you don't want to waste your efforts on doing any of the powerful gear drops. Instead, just head to a vendor and level them up until you get the piece of gear you need to replace the one that's falling behind. They will give you gear at or just below your base power level. Now, in order to make this even more efficient, head to the website vendorengrams.xyz. I will leave a link to this website below in the description. Now, when you go there, they will actually show which vendors are dropping gear at a higher level. So the ones that are dropping at a higher level will give you gear at your base power level. So you don't have to spend as many resources. Now, if you find yourself running out of these resources that you're needing to spend, you can always head to Spider in the Tangled Shore and see if he's selling the resources you need. Now, after you filled in those gaps and replaced any low level gear that you needed, go back to grinding out the activities that do the powerful gear drops and then rinse and repeat. This is absolutely the most efficient way to spend your time leveling your character. Now, if you want to take this strategy and absolutely maximize this potential and you have a little bit more time to grind out these activities, I highly recommend using three different characters. So the way you do this is send your weapons to a second character that is going to drastically increase their base power. And then you're going to do activities as you would to get armor to drop at a higher level, making your base power even higher. And then again, send your weapons over to the third character, grind out activities, get armor to drop, raising your base power even higher than the first one. Now, obviously, you want to start off with the character that you play the least. That way, the last character, your main, is going to be the one that ends up with the highest base power light. All right, guys, I hope this video helped you guys out in your grind. If you could, please leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and as always, good luck and have fun.